all right what's going on guys so in today's video i thought it'd be a lot of fun kind of as like a 300k special to look back on some of my older videos and just kind of give you guys a thank you for everything you guys have done for me the views have been absolutely insane i mean you guys can see the views here on the channel are absolutely crazy a lot of videos with over a million views a bunch of hundreds of thousands completely unreal so i really do appreciate it thank you guys so much for that but with that being said, I did think it'd be a lot of fun to sort by oldest and take a look at some of my older videos that I posted and just see how far I've come. You know, it's been four years since my uh, public videos have been posted. I'm going to show you guys a couple of videos that are a little bit older than that. I've got some that are probably closer to five, maybe six years old here on the channel. So we're going to take a look at those. But anyways, if you guys enjoy this video, please consider liking the video. Subscribe if you're new. I do post daily videos here on the channel. And let's get straight into these videos. Alrighty, so I thought it would only be right to start with my first ever video on the channel. Now, I did have a couple other channels. I think I started one other channel before I started this one. And I had a couple videos on it, I think. But this is the oldest video that i still have on the channel it is privated i've got a lot of videos privated um so the videos you see here are the oldest that aren't privated but we'll take a look at those in a second but basically the way i used to upload to youtube back in the day was i would shadow play past four minutes you can see the video is four minutes long i would just like hit shadow play and in shadow play there's an option to like export the videos straight to youtube so that's what i did so there's no editing so like the clip that i'm trying to show is like all the way up here um <laughs> but i just uploaded the full thing and this is like you guys can tell like just by the operator select screen this is years and years and years ago i mean it's crazy to look back on even with the the jaeger acog i was playing on a laptop here at the time I was on 75 hertz and the laptop would often overheat and drop to like 20 fps and i was using a plank of wood as my mouse pad and i was playing on 4000 dpi right here so my uh mechanical skill is well it's god awful but it does give you guys hope to like see where i came from i used to be so bad at this game i mean you guys are gonna see it in a second i think we can skip ahead a little bit more I mean, I used to be so bad at this game and I'm still not that good. I've improved a little bit. <laughs> I, I'd say, I guess I've improved a lot since this time, but um, yeah, a little bit of a motivational video for you guys. You can see how far I've come. It's possible to get better. I love this pre-fire right here. Look how bad it is. That was a crazy pre-fire, wasn't it? <laughs> And then I get the last kill up here. And then and then you can see how bad I am because I typed ace when I get the, the the ace. Like only bad players type ace after they get the ace. I swear to God. But yeah, that was uh, my first ever YouTube video. So pretty interesting to look back on. A lot of these videos, sadly, I'm not gonna be able to play in this video because they are montages with copyrighted sounds. All, a lot of these montages are pretty good though. So if you guys like, if you guys want to watch them, I have a montage playlist. So you guys can check them out. We'll watch another one. This is also from 2017. We'll watch some newer ones too. And by newer, I mean like 2018, 2019. So not that new. But my name is uh, Shock Solar here. This is back when I played comp. So I haven't played uh, comp in years. You know, what would be fun, what we'll do, one of the videos we look at, we'll look at one of my comp pilot videos. And there's a, there's actually a clip in there that is one of my best clips ever, in my opinion. It's a, it's a really solid clip. Let's skip ahead a little bit. And then I lost, unlucky. I used to be an SMG 11 gunner. So back when I played comp, I was more of like the supportive role or like flex role. Um, I, I actually, I switched between a lot of different roles. At one point I was the main entry fragger. At another, I was the flex. At another point I was hard breach. So like hard support. Um, I've used to IGL. I did a lot of different things. But at the time I was the smoke player. The big thing is I love to play smoke. So I would be like 
ash on attack and then smoke on defense it made no sense but uh hey it's what i did oh yeah make sure to follow me on twitter guys it's still that's still my app by the way this has got to be let me pause really quickly this could perhaps be my best clip ever aim wise it's not that good i have better looking clips but in terms of like getting an ace um this might be my best ace ever it was uh an ace i got with one mag so only 30 bullets in 13 seconds all headshots I have six bullets right now and i get the last two kills two bullets left might be my best ace ever i'm gonna be honest with you guys i don't know if i've ever gotten an ace that fast with that uh low of ammo before besides this clip right here i was a big sledge player back in the day like i am too not much has changed man not much has changed still play a ton of sledge so this is back when i joined disrupt gaming and what a lot of people didn't know is that i used to be on a team called team xeno and then shortly after i was off the team they like rebranded to oblivion so like a lot of people didn't know this but this is like the peak of my comp career so lebronic is iconic who's on astralis right now um and then there's also j90 who is on astralis that was one of my old teammates um and then ryan right there that you just saw through the wall that was one of my teammates so the roster was me um there's j90 me j90 iconic um quantum and ryan i love that team so much that was the peak of my comp career i love these guys so much i think um quantum quit and ryan quit and then i quit but the two guys that stayed they went to pro league all right so i i think it's only right that we show this little clip this was one of my first big videos i it actually might be my first video on the channel to hit 100,000 views i don't believe i had it yeah this is this is the first video on my channel to hit 100,000 views 1v5 against king george this is like if, if you guys have been like around on my channel for a while a lot of you guys probably found me from this video if you guys did if you guys found me from this video let me know down in the comments you guys either found me from this video or you found me from my l or no recoil videos and if you're a more recent viewer then you probably found me through the versus series but regardless play, play together this guy's just a baiting fucking loser so yeah kg's not a big fan of me um he just, he just clicked out to the right that's easy this is uh old bank little 1v5 i had against kg and them i don't know if i'll show the full 1v5 because it is kind of long but we'll show we'll show a couple seconds of it but this is um yeah this was my best video at the time this really propelled my channel forwards there's me killing george he got he got so mad when he died here too it's actually funny i have no beef against george but he hates me like you gotta you gotta give george some slack though because like back when back when these uh railings weren't destructible it, like you could not win this fight like there was zero chance he was winning that against me yeah that, that was uh th this was a, a a fun little video if you guys want to see the full 1v5 just uh search up 1v5 against king george shock you guys will find it no problem yeah, so here's another um no recoil video that popped off for me i think this was my first no recoil video if i'm not mistaken i was kind of known for playing ella amongst my friends and everyone was so confused like how do you how can you play ella so well like i don't understand like she has too much recoil so i was like all right i'll just make a video out of this no recoil ella main so the video basically was me showing off this setup and the setup was angled iron sights and flash hider and it honestly felt like it had a lot less recoil i mean you can see too like the recoil is not that bad it's really not that bad the, the iron sights aren't that good though to be honest with you they really weren't but I'll go show you guys another Ella video that you guys probably found me from. If it wasn't this Ella video, it's this other one that I'll show you guys. Yeah, so here we go. So here's another SMG 11 video really quickly. Just wanted to go over that. That was another big video for me. So I, I started kind of seeing the trend of uh, 
these no recoil videos were doing really good so i started to make more of them with different guns and now even recently if we go to my channel you guys will see that i've been bringing the trend back we go to my most recent videos no recoil smg 11 no recoil ella i'm bringing it back baby we're going full circle we're going back to my roots with the ella clips and the smg 11 clips i promise you oh uh, yes the first time i hit champ so i'm kind of a fraud the first time i ever hit champ was in steel wave i kind of suck this this right here might be one of my best clips ever this is against a bunch of comp players these guys are like cl players high champion players this is one of my best clips ever i get a little bit loud here so prepare yourself for that <laughs> and then that's my friend reflect freaking out that i hit that clip this is the first time i ever hit champ i was so hyped for it i was so hyped and then right after i got an alpha pack I was so hyped, bro. I was so hyped. And I think this clip was against a pro stack. So this was like Yardy and uh, a bunch of pros. This was um, part of that same, uh, or not the same game as before, but this was this is like the game before my champ. Um, and what, what's funny about this clip is that Yardy was losing his mind in all chat. He was like, who are my teammates? Because <laughs> I think we 4 0 them here. Like, we 4 0 a pro stack. It did, like, we just should never have won this. It didn't make any sense for us to win it. But me and Reflect, my friend, we went off right here. Him and I had so much passion this season. Like, just hear it. You can hear it in my voice. Like, just listen to me. Listen to how hype I get right here when we win. Yes! Let's go, bro. Woo! I got so hyped back in the day, bro. Like, back when I played Comp 2, man, I used to get so hyped. I miss it, bro. I miss it. I don't have the passion I used to. I don't know what happened. It's honestly sad. I, I wish I had the same passion, man. I really do. Okay, here we go. We're going to watch this video. It's a little bit cringe. This is, uh, this is my first attempt at trying to get into, like, more personality-based content. Um... I was trying to do more funny content. Basically, the premise here is the actual real bomb site is downstairs. So you see, like, the bomb site is down here in the basement. And the idea was we would all run up to the main bomb site because on Canal, most people assume the first pick for the defenders is going to be top floor. Everyone kind of assumes the defenders go up here to this bomb site first and then they go downstairs. Well, what we did is I went Mozzie and I tried to get as many drones as I possibly could. And um, basically we tried to site fake. So like we made them think we're up here and not downstairs. And we had them kind of play into this. So they used all their drones, all their utility, all their time on it here. The problem is my editing sucked. My editing sucks. <laughs> my my thumbnails were uh or my, not my thumbnails. My subtitling was a bit over the top. The th the, the text was too big. The font kind of sucked. But it wasn't that bad. This was a ton of fun though. I actually, I loved making this video. And then we ended up winning the round, and they had no idea. And what's great about this is you can go to the second you can go to the top bomb site next um and usually they're not ready for it but yeah this was a ton of fun to make man i killed thermite back to back rounds this is the most replay part of the video i think i hit like a nasty clip right here this is uh the roni pre-nerf as well 21 bullets no recoil 1.5 absolutely nasty weapon like imagine dying to that bro imagine all right so here we're getting into kind of the drought of my channel i i didn't really know where i wanted to go with my channel i had i had some videos do good like if you look like 80k views 80k 120k like that's not bad um but my channel was doing really bad like 20k 20k i, I know like that could come off as me sounding ungrateful but it's it's not that it's that my channel was doing significantly better at a certain point and ended up doing a lot worse um and like i had some videos who good like this has 300k but this got 300k like over the whole year this this video's been out for almost two years now and it did not get that many views right off release same with this video but anyways my point is um my channel was doing really 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 bad like 15k views 11k views um it was bad and i i really didn't know what to do 
Um, you can see I uploaded a sponsored video that got 15k views, which absolutely killed my channel in the algorithm. Like YouTube hated me for uploading this video. It was not worth it. Um, and then I uploaded a Warzone video because I thought like I was done in Siege and I just had to switch games because my views were so bad. But thank God I found my break with these Ubisoft broke videos. So I, I did this one. Ubisoft added a new crossbow. And it, this is when the battle pass came out. I don't I don't know if it was the first time or not, but it was the first 3D skin. It was the crossbow skin for Vigil. And that did really well. So I moved into Ubisoft broke Ella and I showed off some Ella clips. And this, this title saved my channel, bro. Everybody loved these uh, Ubisoft broke videos. So I grinded them for months. I made a bunch of Ubisoft broke videos. I'll show you guys. Definitely revived my channel. It was amazing. I don't even know what this clip is. I kind of forget. Yeah, the recoil control is not bad, to be honest. This is still what I was doing intros. I've learned so much since uh since this period. I mean, it's crazy. Like this was in June of 2021. So like basically exactly a year ago, this video was posted pretty much. It's just crazy how far my channel's come in just the past year. Like, literally, this video would be completely unacceptable to post to my channel nowadays. So, a lot, a lot has changed for sure. Yeah, so you guys can see, like, my channel started doing way better. If you compare the views, it's getting like 15, 20,000 a video. And now it's like 100K, 180K, 140K, 100K. Like... My, my channel did so much better this time. This was a huge boost in my channel. Really gave me the motivation to like grind out YouTube again. So that that was amazing. That was uh that was good. And then the Ubisoft broke trend started to die and my channel went with it. And I went back into this drought of views. And this is how YouTube is. Like the second your titles and thumbnails are off, you just go into this drought. And unfortunately, I went back into one, but I was able to get out of it shortly after this period of videos. Um, I uploaded this 1v1 every rank video and it did really, really, really good. And after these few videos here, my channel just exploded. Like as of recently, like it's, it's been, it's been insane. Like this video, 1.6 million views. Like, yeah, it was crazy. Like my channel did so good. So I really appreciate you guys watching all the videos uh subscribing it means a lot to me i gained like half my subscribers in the past year i mean it's mind-blowing so i really do appreciate all the support that you guys have given me over the years i've come a long way um i think it's really cool to kind of look back and see like you know like i was showing you guys before if we look at my most popular videos they're all in the past couple months and i've been grinding the youtube game for four years that you can see but more like six years i've been grinding my ass off on youtube trying to make it somewhere and uh eventually i finally did and it's all thanks to you guys so i really do appreciate you guys helping me out with all of that and hopefully this gives you some motivation to upload your own videos and yeah if you guys enjoyed this video feel free to like the video it really does help out the youtube algorithm especially when you guys drop a comment as well drop your favorite video for mine or actually drop what video you found my channel from that makes sense drop that down in the comments i really sincerely would love to know which video you guys found me from but with that being said subscribe if you're new turn notifications on if you have not already i post daily videos on the channel and with that being said thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day